Building four, a new business incubator is being built in one of Lakeland's most underserved communities. ABC Action News reporter Rebecca Petit today taking a closer look at how it's giving local entrepreneurs the chance to grow their business while redeveloping that area. And so the front doors will be here. The vision of Dr. Sally Stone is beginning to become a reality. Construction of her concept for a business resource center called The Well is now underway. If you think back in ancient times, the well in the center of a community was the sign of a healthy community. And when people gathered at the well, they gathered to do business, they gathered to network. Located in Lakeland's underserved Midtown neighborhood, The Well will help residents start or grow their business with a focus on businesses owned by women, veterans, and people of color. It provides training and professional development, seminars and workshops, but is intentionally focused on the underserved and underrepresented populations that many times are marginalized or may not have access to resources. The business center will offer a co-working space, media room, podcast, and music studios. Dozens of entrepreneurs have already begun signing up to use the workspace. This location is so wonderful. It's centrally located and it's a place where other people with like minds will come and we can collaborate. The well is also partnering with Florida Polytechnic University's entrepreneurship program. Internships both with the well itself and with some of the companies that would occupy space at the well and then hopefully uh, there'll be opportunities for jobs. The Lakeland Community Redevelopment Agency is funding the $1.3 million project as part of the organization's goal of redeveloping districts to improve the quality of life for residents. The well is scheduled to open early next year. In Lakeland, Rebecca Petit, ABC Action News.